All right, guys, a little unpackaging video for you. Uh, this is the ULAC, uh, ULAC Hybrid Shockproof Protective Case for the Apple iPhone 6. And they do it for other devices as well. And this is how it's come shipped to me. Um, I'm not sure whether there is actually any uh, particular sort of any sort of uh, point of sale stuff because it seems that it's all mainly sort of like internet based uh, this uh, through Amazon. Now, a uh, big thank you to the uh, to you lack for sorting this out for me. Uh, as you can see, you get a screen protector and a cloth and a squeegee. So now I won't actually be putting that on because I've already got one on my wife's iPhone 6 here. Uh, one you've seen in previous videos that already has a, a nice little crack in the screen there. Um, so this one is like I say, it's a um, it's a, a dual sort of, I think it's a three layer protection in this one. Um, now there's no built-in screen protector as there is with like um, Otterbox and stuff like that. Um, so that's why they provide that. So, I, but I don't need to, like I say, I don't need to uh, apply that. So we'll have a quick look around. You can right now you can see you've got access to your microphone port there. Um, clear access to the speaker, no access for charging. So anyway, let's uh, get into it and we'll uh, have a look. So, pretty simple, you take that off, just undo these uh, little port covers. Take that off there, that off there, and pretty much all uh, sort of fastens the same way. Similar sort of uh, design. Uh, clip wise as the otter boxes and that's it so you get the three it's three pieces basically like that um, just basically like a, a honeycomb sort of finish on there and if we put that in there that's a very snug fit actually that's that's actually a perfect fit there's no movement in that like you get with some I've noticed you do actually get a little bit of side to side play in these but there's none whatsoever in that so that's quite impressive in that sort of sense and put this on and as you can see they've offset all this uh, so it just leaves you enough room there for the front facing camera and your earpiece just snap all those on that snaps on quite easily actually uh, good, good plenty of wide opening there for camera uh, just a shame that there's no opening in there unless uh, I see it could be that you open that wide apart okay let's put it back on anyway and we'll see but um, anyway you can see that's a good fit in there so put that on and it's pretty much the same as the otter box you've just got this little lip that comes around the front uh, not waterproof um, by any means um, but should give plenty of shock protection so we've got that on and we're on there and there and that's it that is on pretty much yeah that's it put the covers back in that's it we're on so that's very tactile uh, no extra sort of feels I think it's going to lose it in time it's a little bit um, you know like um, like when you get these uh, rubber gloves and they've got like that they've got like a a semi sort of like they've got uh, like dust on them although there isn't any dust on this but it feels a bit like that it um, it is a you know it is, it is budget level um, price wise I think more than worth it and that has got loads of, in fact that's yeah that's going to give you absolutely loads of uh, drop protection there that's something I really wouldn't worry about uh, dropping it in one of these uh, see that's some certain ones so I'm just wondering if that one yeah I think that is how you're supposed to yeah there you go you see so that is how you would actually charge it I was expecting you know something more like these sort of port covers here You've got plenty of room around the headphone jack there. Uh, you would obviously, or would you? No, they've even left you a little hole there, and that, I don't think you can see it 
on here very well but there is a little hole just there that is lining up pretty much perfectly with the microphone I can see the microphone at the bottom of it so that's actually pretty good um, as I said before a huge opening for the camera you're not going to get any flashback uh, woes from that so yeah like I say this this feels a little sort of loose to be honest um, I think it'll probably go back in in time um, for the price you can't go wrong you know you are getting protection on a shoestring here basically I would definitely uh, pay the money for one of these at the moment I think uh, the minute you can pick these up for about six pounds seven pounds something like that which for this kind of case is very very uh, cheap and very reasonable actually so to have one of these lying around at home just for that time when you do go uh, anywhere a bit more rough and rugged then definitely worth it um, it's got plenty of grip around these edges here uh, so you're definitely not going to drop it so leave your comments underneath guys let me know what you think of it and uh, I will also leave some links underneath because you lack are having a very uh, impressive sale at the minute uh, not on these particular ones but on many of their cases and they do cases for all sorts so well worth checking the links that I will leave below guys and I will see you in the next video guys okay cheers see you